guys what's up welcome to my channel hope you guys are doing well thank you so much for tuning into this video my name is esther and if you are new to my channel welcome <laughs> i think i do that like enough times now so as you guys can see i am rocking this wig which is not like my usual style which is one thing i really love about it i'm rocking this super wavy curly type summery vibe and i'm really really loving it i'm going to give you guys all the details to this wig if you just stay tuned <laughs> So here we have myself and Kel, and Kel has already worked her magic on this wig off camera. She went in and she customised the front of the lace. She tweezed a lot of the hair off so that it could look a lot more natural once she's laid it down. Kel is using the Got To Be Ultra Glued Gel and she's just placing that all in the front of my hairline. And she's gonna blow dry that to make sure it's tacky. Then she goes ahead and lays that down really carefully. And then afterwards she just customises the front a little bit more by adding some baby hairs to the hairline. And then she puts me under the dryer, as you can see here she's wrapping the front of the hairline, so that the scarf can press it down really really well, make it flat and lay really perfectly. And then she puts me under the dryer. She goes ahead and she wets the hair with some water and some conditioner and she brushes it out really really nicely just to style the hair. It doesn't take a lot of styling, it doesn't take a lot of effort which is a good thing. You kind of just need to wet the hair, moisturise it a little bit and you're ready to go. So before we get started, I need to let you guys in on something. I am bung over. I'm not feeling very good. My sinuses are playing up. I don't know whether or not it's because of hay fever or it's because of the cold. I don't know because we, we literally get four seasons in one day in London and it's not good for anyone's system. So I'm a little bit bunged up. So please excuse the sound of my voice, but we're going to get on with it anyway. So like I said in the beginning, I'm going to share the details of this wig for you guys. And I am rocking a lace frontal wig, honey. Yes. This wig on my head is from Elfin Hair and they sent me a ready-made wig, which was super easy. Because that meant I didn't really need to go through the hassle of making the wig myself. Manual labor. So Elfin Hair actually shipped this wig in this box and it came in this paper box, which is a bit destroyed now because it's sort of been sitting around. And inside it was the wig in a clear plastic packaging. And then you've got a booklet here that says instructions on how to take care of your hair. It's got do's and don'ts, how to shampoo, which shampoo they recommend, heat, protection and it had in here oh cute it had in here the card for their company so social medias and all that kind of stuff having them in some sort of packaging i think is always a fab idea so i am wearing a 22 inch loose curly lace frontal wig it has 150 density on the wig itself and it was pre-plucked so when a wig is pre-plucked it means that easier for you to customize when it comes to tweezing any of the hairs out some people may choose not to do any further plucking some people obviously may choose just to continue customizing it until it's absolutely perfect for them which means they've taken some of the work away from you um, and they've eased you up a little bit and they said you don't have to pluck as much as you would with a general frontal because of course all the hair is embedded into the lace which means it's a nice full thick bed of hair and with customization to make it look like your hairline and stuff like that you do need to then pluck some of those hairs out so they basically do some of the job for you and you continue with customization of course if you wish it had an extra bit of lace all around the front and lace all at the back and this is lace that obviously we've cut and created the hairline now I didn't do any of the customization myself I went to see her by Kel who is based in London and I asked her to help me out with this wig and put her touch on it and she did a fab job I absolutely love it it reminds me of a genuine hairline it's not too scanty it's not too full and she made it look really really good it is so cute like I really love the curls they're loose curls you could probably run a brush through this easily when it's wet and that's exactly what Kel did as well she finished bleaching the knots and she was washing the bleach out of it she obviously had to get the hair wet and just as she was combing through it it was really really easy the brush was just literally flowing through the hair so of course that's one thing you want to look for as well how does the hair work when it's wet when it's how does the hair still feel when it's been manipulated until it's styled how does the hair look and how does it feel through that process and this one held up really really well even to style she just put some water and 
conditioner I, she had a spray bottle and I, I forgot to ask her but I'm guessing it's water and conditioner she just sprayed that all over the hair we scrunched it up and I was ready to go and it's held up really really pretty all day minus having to customize the front of the wig right here my hairline she had to bleach the knots but she took it out of the packaging she noticed immediately that the knots weren't bleached so she went ahead and she basically did that right off the bat and then that's how we got to this brownish tone underneath here and I believe she used a little bit of my foundation powder just to buff on the inside of the lace there so it matches my skin tone even more and I think that's pretty much everything that I wanted to really really share with you guys um, I'm really loving this hair I love the look and because it's 22 inch it only reaches about here it kind of just reaches there I may even trim like this excess off a little bit just because I think it's been a little bit straggly. You don't really need all of that. One thing that Kel obviously did mention that the cap or, or the wig wasn't big enough. I mean, when I was contacted by them, they didn't ask me for my head measurements. So I think they just kind of went ahead and sent any size. I'm not sure if this is like one size fits all because if that's the case, I've got a really small head as it is and this cap is quite small for me. It feels like it is where it shouldn't be. It's not super small, but at the same time, of course, you need to consider having a lot more space when it comes to creating this hairline with the, with the lace front and as well just it being comfortable for you at the back as well like I said it's not on the small uncomfortable side but I can feel that it is smaller than how I usually have my wig I think that was the only thing that was mentioned by Kel that she noticed um, and I kind of felt it as well when obviously I was having it kind of fitted on me head but yeah the hair is so cute yeah I'm really loving this style we put it in a side part thank you so much Kel for customizing this wig for me check out the description box below for all the links to her socials and ways you can get in touch with her as well if you'd like her to slay one of your wigs girl Oh, you better check the description box not just that but make sure you check out elf in hair if you're looking for lace front wigs if you are looking for best quality and most competitive price because that's what it says on their box you guys make sure you check out elf in hair they've got wigs for affordable prices and great quality of course like i mentioned and of course that just takes all the hard work away from you you don't need to find a wig maker you don't need to learn how to customize frontals you just get it and you trim the lace off and you're good to go girl so make sure you check out the description box for the link to the elfin hair website all the links to their social media as well if you've got any questions please drop them in the comment section below and i will be more than happy to answer your questions guys also don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you go and i'll see you guys real soon bye